Okay guys, we are now at Pulau Bin and still we ice cream. Oh well, no not ice cream yet, no ice cream yet. Uh, Timothy down there had one, Baramandi earlier, Kenji ha and me, we currently still stand at a zero. Right? Um so we are like arrived here pretty early today. I think it was almost about 6.50 or 7. Uh, no activities, no nothing. Even the bike shop wasn't open. So the fishing pond uncle never released the fish, so we didn't catch fish. Lah. Right. So we got our bikes. Basically today's trip is to explore new areas and we found a little entry to this place where it used to be the old chalet. You know, apparently it's no longer there now, uh, somewhere behind there. Uh, apparently they closed down and they uh, moved in front of Ubin. What I heard what I hear say last time was because uh, it is a haunted place at night. So basically they close operations and push in front. Not sure is it true or not, but nonetheless we are here. Uh, this used to be I think one of the inlet the the mouth uh, of the mangrove system that leads to the second bridge. Right? Um, so we're gonna try here for a while and see whether or not there's gonna be a fish or not. Right. If not, as the tide goes up, we will start going back to the different places and keep on trying and to see what we can do. But please stay tuned to the end of the video. There's going to be something very special um, that's going to happen. So see you guys later. Bye. Fish on, fish on. I can't really hop over while I'm recording. How am I going to land it? Uh, can you pull it up? Is your line long enough or do you need a net? I long enough. Sorry, not long. Is, is it strong enough? enough? Strong enough, yeah. Oh, the colour's nice. You sure you don't want me to get net? Uh, I think I think. Nice, man. Oh, yeah. No, no. Only dumb. Only dumb. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's not a bad size. Oh, yeah. Woo. guys so we are now at Amas drink stall at Pulau Ubin it's currently raining um, so far the update has been Timothy has caught one uh, bara I've lost my shoe and two leos <laughs> so, <laughs> I lost basically I stuck two duo leos here so those who come here and find two duo leos good luck to you right and upon trying to retrieve it my boots actually kind of broke so quite lucky Timothy has a spare kind of slip on so I'm using them now and I trash those away. So yeah. So since it's raining, I'm gonna take this time to show you guys our gears or what we uh, bring to Ubin when we fish lah. Okay, so first up today my intention was to use hard leos. So this is the Mino I'm using 85 by duo, a jerk bait 85 suspending, white in colour. Um Basically, a lot of deal uh, release another jerk bait. Ouch! Uh, 100 suspending by Tiger. I have the Ryuki spearhead as well and stuff. So, I'm using a lot of slim profile baits, right? Uh, sinking, suspending, floating. Uh, I was trying also if, if luck allows the Evergreen Justin, which uh, unfortunately luck wasn't here with us. so no chance so i try to get it down to yeah. so this is the evergreen justin um didn't have luck with that basically had no luck at all i tried to switch down to even smaller spearhead ryuki leos like 70 versions but 
no luck as well so only luck came with rubbers okay so for grudge itself i've kind of prepared the cultiva rock and bait two inch uh, twin tier and also the one and a half inch jack all shed and two inch stuff so yeah also when you're out there bring energy bars for food if you're hungry <laughs> a lot of pliers long nose short nose whatever nose okay and um, yeah so currently I'm actually using a 20 pound pro carbon leader uh, with a to a 10 pound braided uh, okay so the lure that actually kind of caught the bar earlier Timothy was using a island adventures island angler sorry no, island anglers is this the one right Yep, I think it's the three inch yeah, woohoo island anglers yeah it's a three inch uh, double padded tail so yeah do check them out you know it says follow us at islandanglers.sg uh, basically it's a local brand made in Singapore I would say uh, up and coming so yeah pretty nice colors I think this will suit very well especially for uh, the mangroves and perhaps like the passeries pond as well dark colors with a bit of gold speckle always you can't go wrong so there's a lot of colorations yeah this this looks like more like the gray prawn which i think looks good black gold gray prawn pretty awesome colors like, like the watermelon yeah it's the watermelon and this is what this one is off-white not so is it super white or off white off white oh, it's off white yeah this is a branded one okay uh, one piece about 100 sing dollars yeah off white no lah that's joking so yeah you do check them out pretty awesome stuff so this is a 3 inch pallet tail uh, but apart from that of course okay let me just turn this around and show you guys yeah they do have many other kinds as well so yeah so here you go these are all all of them uh. Um, majority only these two are not yeah so these are used so yeah. majority are all from uh, island anglers itself so you have a fanatic down here <laughs> that swears by it as well yeah man so that's what we use when we go to Pulau Bin and this is what we do when we are now trapped in the rain uh, trying to do <laughs> gears reviews for you at Ubin right so yeah, rod wise, I'm using a 817 Rapala Vatsky paired with a Calcutta 200. Right, so I think they're all pretty much on BFS and ultra light gears and stuff like that. So I'm the only one that's going a bit heavy. And it proved to be the wrong move. So go light, I'll go home. <laughs> that's right. Go light, I'll go home. That's, that's the next, next month's design. <laughs> yeah, man. Okay, till then hopefully the rain stops and uh, yeah we need to head back shore by one we have uh, just Lazat has kindly so kindly sponsored us lunch so we're going to get back to our satays and nasi lemak show you guys good food so do check them out link and description will be in below so yeah do check them out later 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 So guys, we are... Oh, that's Timothy there. Yes. Uh, I'm blocking out the mystery man. Yeah. My head is very big. <laughs> <laughs> so we're waiting for our food from Just Lazard. Uh, I think it's just around the corner. Uh, he's at Changi Village. I think he's turning in. Uh, it's a biker. Hey, yeah. I think so. It's a... Just Lazard, is it? Hey! hey. <laughs> so the delivery guy is here. Hey! Thank you so much. Just Lazat, so hot food of the press. Yes. Yay. <laughs> Hungry times, man. So, yeah, food time. So, thank you so much. Wow, right. look at that. Yeah, it was awesome. Food. <laughs> so, yeah, so we're going to the hawker center, open up the food, and show you guys what's inside, yeah? Let's go, let's go. So 
This is a whole lot, man. We're going to have all this for lunch. Thank you so much once again for the food. Hope you guys enjoyed the video so far. Uh, till the next one, I guess. See you guys. Bye. Tim Timothy, what do you like about the food so far? The satay, the beef and the mutton is so damn delicious. It's so good. Yeah. I haven't tried nasi lemak yet, but I bet it's going to be good as well. Awesome, awesome. Not spicy.